All right, hello and welcome everyone to Delaware Auto Sales. This early evening, we're going to take a look at this very nice magnetic gray Toyota Corolla. This is a 2010. This is a S trim line Corolla, 138,000 miles on this car. So very reasonable, respectable miles for its age and its year. Uh, I will just go ahead and say right here, right now at this moment, if you are looking for lower mileage, we have that too. We have a couple of other Corollas, a 2009 and 2010, that are silver. Uh, not S models, but nice cars that are listed right now as well that have 50, like 52,000 on one and 54,000 miles on another. So we've got some low mileage ones also. But I think this is very uh, reasonable mileage and it's certainly a good looking S car as you see here. Uh, rear spoiler on the S's right there, the body cladding pieces down below give it a sporty look here's our website and phone number you can take a look on there to see the still photography of the car that I took um, as well as link to the Carfax report Carfax is clean it's a clean Carfax report yes it is uh, super fuel mileage in these cars great fuel mileage great gas saving car great car for a first-time driver easy to see and navigate and park. That's a factory sunroof right there. Um, just uh, nice, nice, reliable and great cars. Toyotas, Hondas, Nissans, Mitsubishis, they're all excellent Japanese cars. Um, this car, we did some service work too, uh, like we do everything. Let's see here, I'm gonna tell you about it. We've replaced the air filter we replaced the cabin air filter. Uh, we installed new tire pressure monitoring sensors on all four tires. Uh, clean and adjusted the rear brakes. And we replaced the timing chain tensioner and its gasket. Not the actual timing chain, no, but the tensioner uh, common to go bad. And this one was making a little noise, so we took care of that. Uh, also replaced the wiper blades and gave it an oil change. Um, the tires have 730 seconds tread remaining in the front and the back. So 730 seconds on the tires. And the brakes have 10 millimeters remaining in the front, which is basically just like new, and five millimeters remaining in the rear. So still plenty of time for the rear brakes because they wear, generally speaking, much more slowly than the fronts. Uh, there's your tires on the front. The 205, 55, 16 is the size. Goodyear Eagles. Nice tires, smooth, quiet. Uh, we'll take a look at each of these wheels. This is a real common problem on Toyotas, this uh, bubbling on the finish. Uh, very common, uh, pretty much unavoidable. This is pretty minor compared to most. Um, there's the cladding piece on the side. See that gives it, gives it all of that body skirt, that lower appearance look. Same thing here, a little bit of that peeling on this wheel. Some of that's water from driving through the water just now. But like right here, some bubbling. Um, not, a, not a big, big deal, but just wanted to point it out. Um, I'm going to show you something on the other side. So I'm going to go ahead and say it on this side. This uh, wheel arch back here is very clean, very nice. Um, on the other side, there is a rust spot <clears throat> that I want to point out and show. Not quite sure why or how, but right there, just so you're aware. A little rust spot right there on that dog leg. The rest of it's very clean. A uh, little scuff on the bumper here that we had uh, touch up paint done on. And there's this wheel. And this wheel right here. Um, the rest of the body and paint is really, really nice. I mean, a few other little tiny marks that have had touch up like, like right there. Um, some stone chips that have been touched up on the hood, but overall really really nice daytime running lights on right there um, Let's take a look inside and that's all of the rest <clears throat> Power windows power locks cruise control um, There's the uh, face page of the Carfax Like I said clean clean Carfax good history three owners original floor mats got a little bit of wear but I like original mats because they cover the floor nicely they're fitted to the right shape of the floor side airbags safe for a young driver 
seats in great shape very durable long lasting there's the factory power sunroof on the headliner so inside here traction control that's to turn it off power mirrors uh, some steering wheel audio controls however uh, these I just realized when I push this those do not work <clears throat> simply because uh, this radio has been replaced but this is a good thing again for anyone or a young driver um, much better technology than obviously the original stuff um, here we have AM FM USB Apple CarPlay, Android mirroring, depending on what kind of phone you have, Bluetooth audio, Bluetooth phone. So all of your current technology, very easy, touch screen, you know, boom, boom, um, swipe, radio, very easy to use. I just put it in reverse, has a really nice crystal clear, look at that, backup camera, real nice image, real clear, real big. So got that going on there. Uh, simple, easy to use climate control, keep drivers from being distracted while driving two glove boxes in these cars don't ask me why original owner's manuals are there first aid kit here a whole nother glove box to put whatever you want in um, one touch sliding sunroof works great Steering wheel, leather or vinyl, I believe this might be vinyl on the outside here though, but very, very nice condition. All the stitching is nice, cruise control. Uh, it does only have one key, but it's a original Toyota key with a keyless entry on it. There's the exact mileage, 138,336. Um, we'll take a look under the hood in a moment. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and pop the hood, pop the trunk. Continue on our journey here. Back seat is very clean as well. Very nice. This does have uh, side airbags in the rear as well, right there on both sides, of course. Uh, backs of the seats are nice. Floor mats back here are like they're supposed to be. It's a nice little car. Trunk carpet, Corolla. Yes, indeed. Let's see what we got down below. Spare tire, tools, jack. Looks like uh, doesn't appear like it's been used. Very clean and nice down here. Little tray on the side. Hold some things from sliding around. The backup camera that was put in with this aftermarket radio was definitely done nicely. The wiring you can tell here has been added to the original wiring for the spoiler, but there's the camera. It's really nice. It's very factory-like, even though it's not. The spoiler is factory, and of course the brake light in it, which is why it already had existing wiring. Very nice. clean all nice all good um, this is the side that had the rust spot but it does stop right there there's nothing inside the jam or anything like that scratch on the door panel not a big deal and very nice passenger seat real nice and firm these seats are they hold up Hold up, hold up, hold up. Like the Energizer Bunny, this car will just keep on going, going and going and going. You can't beat it. There's our final floor mat. So it's got all four original floor mats, the trunk mat, the owner's manuals, the first aid kit, all very complete other than uh, just having one key. However, we do have an awesome key guy that makes those keys for a very reasonable price. So we can refer you right over to him and get you Second key made if you like, or three, depending on how how many keys you want. So quiet, barely hear it running.
the date code on the side of the battery. 5 of 21. That's good. Not very old either. We test batteries to make sure that they're up to par and we replace the ones that aren't. But this clearly probably passed with no problem since it's pretty new. I'm just going to um, hover here so you can listen to this. And don't quote me on this because I am not a mechanic, but it appears to me, maybe, if, I don't know if that's the starter right there or not, but something right there is real new. It looks to be about the right size and shape of a starter, but it's another new part, which I don't think is one that we installed, so something else that's relatively new might be the starter. I don't know. I know a lot about cars because I've been doing this for a long time, but I've never been a mechanic. Um, just take another look around the outside here. It is a nice color, magnetic gray metallic. Please uh, feel free to reach out with any questions. Uh, if there's anything I haven't covered here or in the photographs or something you're unclear about, please ask. Happy to answer any and all of your questions. <clears throat> Take a look at the photos and the Carfax on our website, like I said. Great car and great car for the price, for sure. There's the website and phone number one more time. And I appreciate your watching and uh, look forward to talking with you or emailing with you about this Corolla or anything else we have that's of interest to you. Make it a great day and thanks again. Bye-bye.